So this is the center point, uh, 6 by 20 power rifle scope with a 50 millimeter objective lens. Uh, this model has uh, illuminated reticle and you can either set the illumination to red or green. Uh, the scope came with a battery for the illuminated reticle. Uh, the scope also came with a set of rings and I use the rings that came with, with the scope uh, to mount the scope on the rifle and uh, these rings have a, a peculiar little setup to attach them to the bases uh, they use a 12 millimeter wrench and I just snug those up and I it has quad Allen screws, set screws in the rings and I set those to about 16 inch pounds uh, with an Allen wrench. Uh, the scope has a nice smooth uh, power ring to set it from 6 to 20 power. It has a nice smooth uh, parallax focus ring that goes from 10 yards to affinity and the focus ring is a nice smooth and easy to turn uh, focus ring. Uh, on the side opposite the windage turret it has a nice uh, center point insignia on the scope. The scope is a beautiful black anodized finish. Uh, it's a really nice looking scope. Uh, the turret cats are threaded quite a way so it takes a while to take them on or off but the windage and elevation adjustments uh, do not require tools and uh, they have a nice crisp click to them and they turn nice and smooth. Uh, the optic quality uh, I noticed at the rifle range uh, that the optic quality uh, was excellent. Even at a full 20 power uh, I had a nice clean crisp view uh, of the targets that I was shooting at. Uh, the scope came from Walmart in a little plastic pack. Uh, it came with an operators and instruction manual, uh, which I did not look at or read. And it also came uh, with uh, a trajectory aiming guide for the tag reticle in the scope. The tag reticle is very similar to a Bushnell ballistic reticle and very similar to the Tasco CF500 reticle. Uh, it has uh, dots, actually triangles, in the reticle for 200, 300, 400, and 500 yards. Uh, this particular rifle is a 223, and I shoot uh, 55 grain VMAX in it. And that's one of the suggested loads that the reticle is supposed to work very well with. Uh, I bore sighted and my first shot was a 10 ring and I played around a little bit with uh, factory ammo to get it just as close as I could. And this was my first group with uh, uh, 23 grains of 30 31 at 100 yards and that's about a three-quarter minute of angle uh, group and uh, all three shots are within the bowl of this uh, loophole 
uh, no, excuse me, Redfield siding target. Uh, then I tried another group of hand loads. Uh, this was 25.5 grains of Varget uh, behind a 55 grain uh, VMAX. And this was, is about a one minute of angle group. So this was the second group that I shot uh, with the rifle scope. And a comparison as to the size of the rifle scope, uh, this is a Tasco uh, 3x9, and it happens to have the CF500 reticle, which is pretty similar to the reticle, uh, tag reticle, uh, on the center point uh, rifle scope. Thank you very much.